So I'm right here adjacent to Oceana and uh, POW MIA Flame of, uh, uh, of Hope Memorial. Although that flame is not running now, I don't know what's happened to it. The park seems to be in a little disrepair. Uh, I think it's privately funded, so there's that. Anyway, uh, one of the things that I've sort of come to understand a little bit is uh, over at Lynn Haven, where we uh, saw the um, the first posting of the uh, Thoroughgood House in that area, and a lot of the earlier postings today. Now we're over here at the uh, site of the Eastern Shore Chapel. Let me read this to you. Originally named for its proximity to the Eastern Shore of Lynn Haven River, the first Eastern Shore Chapel was built elsewhere by 1689. The vestry of Lynn Haven Parish commissioned the building of the third Eastern Shore Chapel in 1754. This brick structure located north of here on the site of the second chapel, circa 1730, had a gable roof skirted by Modillion cornices, typical of Virginia's simpler colonial churches. Because of the expansion of the Naval Air Station, Oceana, this chapel was dismantled in 1952. Built to the northwest of here, the current church was completed in 1954 and took selected remnants of the interior fabric, including the gallery steps and pews from the 1754 building. So it'll be inter interesting to find out where that uh, Eastern Shore Chapel is. Anyway, um, like I said, we're right over here by Oceana Naval Base. Air Base, I guess it's Air Naval. I should know that, but uh, I know there's planes flying. I can tell you that much. But uh, yeah, we might see one. There's one now. Flying quick. Look at that. Anyway, Motley Patriot bringing you a little Virginia Beach history where a lot of this stuff took its first footprint. Thanks for tuning in.